626 North Laramie. It's a routine call for Chicago Fire Battalion Chief Tom O'Donnell. Can't blow this. These lights down here. And as fires go, they don't get any more routine than this. Thick smoke down the alley confirms the radio dispatch 90 seconds earlier. A garage fire. Battalion 13, I'm on the scene with this alley garage. We'll be using the deck on 96 and a... Uh, Four and a half inch line off 117. Well, this is a case of arson here. We stole an automobile in the garage. And I'll get the police here. Fighting fires is Tom O'Donnell's life. He's been at it 39 years, all but one spent in the same West Side neighborhood he grew up in. Was born and raised here. I've been here all my life, and I'm very familiar with it. I drank in every tavern on this area, too. <laughs> I was married and we had our wedding reception in this big hall here called the Knights of Columbus. Boogie. Hall right here, and as you can see, it's all burned out. Fires and other symptoms of urban decay have taken their toll on these west side neighborhoods. Now O'Donnell feels they're coming back. It's got a future in it. At one time, I never thought anything had ever come of it, but they, they've done a lot to rejuvenate the area and improve conditions throughout the district. The Chicago Fire Department's 4th District Headquarters, the pride of the west side, is one of four firehouses O'Donnell is responsible for. Here, here's some real pictures here. You want to take some pictures? Huh? There's a reason for the friendly atmosphere. Firefighters are on duty for 24 hours, and keeping it loose makes for a tightly knit unit. Giant 13, I'm back in service in my own... Outside, it's nightfall, and our veteran fire chief is back on the streets. A drive through the west side with Tom O'Donnell is a trip through history. He remembers fighting one of the city's most tragic fires, a 1958 blaze that killed 95 people at Our Lady of Angels School. I think I'm the last active fireman, active fireman that worked at Our Lady of Angels. There it is right there. Our next call is a tire fire on Maypole Avenue. This is Lake Street. I love to take Lake Street. Although I hit these pillars once in a while. <laughs> I got the truck coming over. Two minutes later, he's on the scene <coughs> and coughing through the smoke. We've got a large pile of tires up against the back door. During a drive back to the fire station with photographer Dave Weaver, O'Donnell is thinking about his retirement years, which are not far off. I'll be on my horse. I'll be fishing for walleyes up in uh, Minnesota and Wisconsin. <laughs> Door County. And here we are, back safe and sound at home. But his immediate thoughts are about retiring, not to Wisconsin, but to bed. Just then, another call comes in. This time, a small fire in an abandoned building. He's battled fires here before. But just an old, dangerous, old, junky old building. He has put out the last fire of his shift. 77, go home. And O'Donnell can call it a night. This is where I stay, and this is where I lay down. <laughs> Chief Tom O'Donnell, a veteran firefighter, and one of Chicago's very own. Such a truck.